Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Omar Bhatt. My name is Omar Bhatt. In the previous video, I explained you, I showed you that how we can create an account in BigCommerce and also I explained some basic things, uh, you know, about the BigCommerce uh, dashboard. In this video, I will teach you, I will show you that how we can add products to online store big commerce so you can see that i have opened my dashboard and uh, on the left sidebar you can see there are different options and one of them is products so we will open products once the product section is open now you can see there are a lot of dummy products i explained in the previous video that these are the dummy products has been added by the platform and uh, if we want to add a new product so you can see here like add or even you can also add from here so I will add from here now you can see the product information you will have to type and uh, on the left sidebar you can see there are products properties like basic information uh, you know under product information then product options then storefront and then fulfillment and uh, then SEO and sharing you can see when I scroll this page from here you can see right now basic information is open so if I scroll down you can see description so description also will highlight here so as we scroll down we can see all these properties make sure and remember one thing that all fields are not mandatory okay only the fields with this static are mandatory if you feel if you fill these fields then you can publish your product but i will definitely recommend to fill all fields but um, i will show you now some you know uh, the basic fields which we need to publish our product so the product name first of all we will type here like if it is a laptop I am typing laptop device for developers you can see SKU it will be automatically generate and you can see here it's not uh, you know red static so it's not mandatory um, the platform big commerce will automatically create SKU stock keeping unit you know for this specific product automatically product type if you are going to send this product you know uh, if using shipping and uh, um, you know some courier service so you will select physical if you are going to publish uh, you know something like uh, ebook or even it might be a software or even it might be a file if you are going to sell the files you know then file or software then you can select digital I will select physical okay now the price you can select for example 10,000 and uh, then weight like for example the weight is 2 kg so you will select 2 kg okay brand it will load like common good OFS or saga form but uh, I will not type the brand here okay categories now shop all right now I will select shop all okay and the description I will type like um, this is a great laptop for the developers okay now the next section about images and videos you can add from URL or you can also upload images from here so I will upload from here like these two images and you can see the images both images are here okay and one of them we can select as a thumbnail the main image okay and uh, you can also you know uh, restore this window this uh, you know Chrome restore and then you can also drag and drop you know images here to upload but I prefer to use upload images from here if you want to add videos 
for your product you can also add from here upload images from same section then you can select and you can see that video will appear here when you have uploaded the images you can also type the description image alternative text image alt text which is very uh, you know good for the SEO on on page SEO so like this is laptop one and this is uh, like laptop second definitely it will be relevant to your product I am just writing you know because this is a laptop so laptop one and laptop second so make sure you will type ALT text as well with the images now the next section variations so variant options we will add from here add variant option and then add variant option from here so you can see we can add color size you know this type of thing like I will select color and uh, the type you can select swatch radio buttons rectangle list and drop down I will select like radio buttons and uh, uh, the default values uh, you know are uh, red green blue one of them we can select default okay and if you want to add more color values for example you have uh, you know like um, yellow color also in this product so you can also add from here okay now you can save variants from here okay so you can add color or size now you can see there are more options and um, store front details search keywords so you can also add keywords for your product if you want okay and you can see all these things are not mandatory condition new or used or refurbished you can select according according to your product uh, this is new so i will select new and um, custom fields fields if you want to add you can add and related products automatically show related products on my storefront okay dimensions you can see 2 kg is appearing if you want to type width height depth uh, in centimeters you can also type okay if you add like shipping cost you can also add or free shipping you can select okay this per this product can be purchased in my online store so you can enable this if it is coming soon then you can select uh, this product is coming soon but i want to take pre-orders and the, this product cannot be purchased in my online store for instance if it is out of stock then you can select okay and uh, if you want to add minimum purchase quantity you can add this one also gift wrapping you know you can also change these options and uh, this this seo and sharing is very important like page title it's uh, you know your uh, product name title product url you can see this is also seo friendly uh, and the meta description you will type about the product here and uh, you can type up to 160 letters uh, you know that is a good description uh, for the off-page seo okay and uh, now you can uh, save this product from here this product has been saved successfully okay so if we click here view products so you can see now our product laptop device for developers has been appeared here and if i view store so you can see in my store if you see shop all so you can see the laptop is here laptop device for developers okay and uh, you can click here and you can see it will open as a new separate new url and here you can see now uh, the title of this uh, product then price of this product sku you can see it's automatically generated and then uh, uh, we also added variations okay and you can see 
a red green blue yellow you can see one more thing if i select green so the sku will update right now it's c112-gr if i select blue so you can see it will update okay so each variant option has its own sku so you can see uh, this uh, is the main thumbnail and then we have another image so users can also see this image if you added the video that will also appear here add to cart so users can add this product to cart and then they can proceed to the uh, you know checkout and um, description you can see you know it's appearing here so in this video we have learned a lot about how to add the, the products you know in um, to your online store a big commerce and uh, in the next video i will definitely describe more about uh, categories uh, of products and more things you know so i hope you have learned a lot in this video and you will definitely share the video with your friends so they can also learn new things they can also learn e-commerce and they can increase their uh, you know online e-commerce skills so and also subscribe to my channel Thank you so much once again.